Hey everybody, Johan Magnussen here, Big Sweet Barbecue. Today we're gonna smoke up some French elk racks with a risotto on the birch barrel. So the first thing that we wanna do is light up the birch barrel. So here's how we do that. We're gonna start by putting some smaller sticks of wood in the birch barrel. Then we're gonna add a couple of fire starter and light them on fire. When we have a good fire going, we can add larger sticks. Now when the birch barrel is started, we want to start preparing the elk. We got two beautiful French elk racks here. The only thing we need to do to them is tie them up with a little bit of butcher twine so they keep the shape better. Then we're going to season them on both sides with our Big Sweet Barbecue Badass Texas Boost. We're going to place the elk rack on the grill grates and then we're going to lift up the grill grate until the grill sits at a temperature of about 350 degrees. Now we want to smoke them like this until they reach an inner temperature of 125 degrees. Halfway through the cook, we want to lower the lid and flip them over and then raise the lid right back up again. So the elk is now on the grill. So the next step, let's get started on the risotto. We're going to start by adding a couple of tablespoons of olive oil to a hot pan. Then we're gonna add two finely diced shallots and saute until translucent. Next, we're gonna add about a cup and a half of arborio rice. We're gonna sweat these together with the shallots for a couple of minutes. Then we're gonna add a cup of white wine and simmer until almost absorbed by the rice. Then we're gonna slowly simmer the rice while constantly adding chicken broth. You probably need a liter or a liter and a half for this cook. When the risotto is starting to turn al dente, we're going to add two tablespoons of butter. We're also going to add two cups of grated Parmesan cheese. And last but not least, we're going to add half a cup of heavy whipping cream. Then you want to stir this and season with salt and pepper. And then it's time to plate it. We're going to scoop some risotto onto a plate. Then we're going to remove the elk rack from the grill and carefully cut the butcher twine, and then we need to slice them into individual chops and serve with the risotto. And that is how I make my smoked elk rack with risotto on the birch barrel. And I think the only thing left to do is to try this and see what it tastes like. And it looks pretty darn good. So here we go. Mm. The elk, tremendous flavor. And then you have the creaminess of the risotto. This is really good. I hope you try it at home. Happy grilling.